Hello everyone, today I want to share a project where I made an integration with N8N, Telegram and Notion. This project is a real case, and the main idea of project is to automate voice input of tasks, and they automatically appear in Notion, and so that this simplifies the task assignment to employees. I made it for one social media influencer, so let's see how it works. Before diving into the project details, uh, let's see how everything works in real time. My solution is built around the Telegram bot and a Notion table. Once the Telegram bot is launched, the user has the option to choose between text and voice input, with the primary focus on voice. First, I send a voice message, and the agent recognizes and structures them in an easy-to-read format. If necessary, we can edit the text or change the task date. Now let's look at the original voice message and compare it with how the AI agent formatted it. I think the result is impressive. And now we will edit the message. Let's, for example, change the number of shorts videos to six. After confirming the changes by clicking the send button, the tasks immediately appear in the Notion table. And how can you make sure task dates are automatically calculated, although we did not specify them specifically in message? And we can also open this table inside the Telegram box, which allows us to see the result from any device. Let's take a closer look at the key components of the project. The system consists of two main Telegram group of nodes, one that handles command reception and another that processes callback events. Their purpose is to guide the user to enter a message, either in text or voice. As soon as a voice message is received, processing begins. First, using an OpenAI method, the audio is converted into text. Then, the AI agent formats it into a reader-friendly version and returns it to the user for confirmation or editing. Interestingly, the system prompt that we pass to the agent includes the current date, which helps it correctly handle deadlines and task dates. Okay, once the user confirms, the second AI agent is launched to convert the text into a structured JSON format. This message is then processed by the Notion node and recorded in the Notion table. And to avoid errors, hallucinations, in the output, I also use a structured output parser that specifies the required format. Finally, the data is passed to the Notion node for proper mapping into the table. Before that, the parse code node is executed, which enhances the processing of the initial data and ensures more accurate mapping. I hope this video was useful and interesting to you. See you in the next video. If you have any ideas, you can write comments and we will do it together on this channel.